Hello, have you ever had somebody throw a stone at you? I hope you haven't and you probably haven't. In the Bible there was someone who was stoned and he hadn't done anything wrong. He'd been preaching about Jesus and doing good things but it made some people very angry and they threw stones at him. But Stephen, instead of trying to hurt those people back, he prayed for them. He was stoned so that he died, but before he died, he prayed, he cried out to God that God would forgive those people. And you probably don't have people throw stones at you, but our words and the things that we do can be like stones. So people may do things to you that hurt you, just like if you get a stone thrown at you, that hurts. And people can say words that hurt you, not your body, but your feelings or well, inside of you can feel very hurt. So what do you do if somebody does that to you? If somebody um, throws a stone at you or they say something really nasty or they do something unkind, what do you do? Do you pick it up and throw it back? Do you say something mean back? Do you try to hurt them back? Or do you do what Stephen did? Do you pray for those people and do something kind back? But Stephen praying for them was doing something kind back. So if somebody hurts you, instead of trying to hurt them back, throwing the stone back, pray for them and do something kind back. And remember that your words and that your actions can be like stones. And don't try to hurt people with your words or with your actions, otherwise you're really just as bad as those people who are throwing stones at Stephen. And Jesus said in Matthew, 5 verse 44, but I say unto you, love your enemies, bless them that curse you, do good to them that hate you, and pray for them which despitefully use you and persecute you. And that is what Jesus did when he was on the cross. He prayed that God would forgive those people. And that is what Stephen did when he was being stoned. So let's remember that and do that when people hurt us.